Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is the wolf by himself, because Raven's not casting games anymore for a while, or forever, maybe, who knows. Anyway, I want to say hello. This is going to be PvP between myself and Edinga, which sounds like a lot of fun to say. Edinga. Say it with me. Edinga. And this is before patch 1.1... Point two, yes, because I haven't played that many games. I don't like playing. I'm kind of like Husky. I do two v twos, but I guess it wouldn't really make a difference because Void Rays are stupid anyway, and I don't need this extra health because he will never get close to me. As I said, I only cast games I win, and this will be like a slaughter fest. So anyway, it's been a while since we've casted a game, and yeah. I'm casting by myself right now, so nothing's happening. I think I'll do a commercial while we wait. Hello, ladies. Look at your man. Now back to me. Now back to your man. Now back to me. Oh, I'm just kidding. I won't do that. So, uh, yeah, scouting with our nine probes. Nothing's going on. We missed each other because my probe took the shorter path. He's way cooler that way. There's the pylon. He's putting down his gateway. Let's see if I can stop him. Go this way. No. Okay, don't go that way. Go over here and get... Okay. Let's see. There is nothing happening. How do casters keep you interested in the first 10 minutes? Or, well, not 10 minutes, because it's only 15 minutes, but... Raven, where are you? I want to talk to you, but you're not real. <laughs> yep, just... Born. Oh, there we go, some sick probe micro. I'm going to get away. No! Oh, oh, poor probe. Blew up right in front of you guys. That was horrific. Oh, I just realized. Yeah, I play this... I play the game on low settings. I can't get my computer to play on medium realistically at any speed so if you don't like watching low settings that's all that's going to be on this channel mostly so you'll have to deal with it or just not watch these videos anymore but you guys know I still love you you're still awesome that way what are you doing here you little probe are you going to sit down a proxy pylon let me help you pylon oh you don't have enough minerals I bet you don't you don't even have any gas oh I'm way ahead of this guy I bet sort of yeah this this pvp had I did kind of an interesting build and because I've casted it once I know it's going to happen but first time I casted it I really didn't remember what was going on uh, so I'm starting off with two gateways got a zealot coming out because zealots are way cooler than marines and zerglings are pretty cute but they're not as cool as zealots I mean, look at that guy he is so awesome cybercore I like I don't like getting more than one gateway like most protoss players he's going to put down same thing. We're pretty much attack of the clones right now. Uh, there's my second gas. Oh, I like the exact same time. I bet that is like the same time. Let's see. Watch them turn the same color. No! His is faster. He's a better Protoss player. But my warp gate is going faster and I'm going to be attacking. Here's some first action. I'm going to go attack with some zealots because zealots are the best. Oh, yes. Get some probes on that. Oh, uh, he doesn't he doesn't have a unit yet, does he? Oh well, I guess everybody who made fun of me on the forum saying making zealots is stupid, you can go to hell because zealots are awesome and not destructible rocks. There we go. So I'm going to go ahead and just push out with these two zealots here. I don't remember my mindset. Pretty much this is my third game out of 3 before the patch that just came out. So I don't remember everything that goes on that I thought about these games. But I'm going to go kill him. And if I had gone a little bit faster, I could have probably beat the sentry that's coming out right now. <laughs> Let's see if he has the APM. APM. To do a sick force field. Come on, you got to save yourself here. There's no way that sentry's going to hold off my zealots that are stupidly running the wrong way. There we go. Good zealots. Force field power, activate. No, you failed now. You will pay the price. He did get one there. It's not bad. Oh, yeah, zealots. Let's see, back at base, I'm getting three gates. Probably going to get a fourth gateway or expand, which is good to do when you're pushing. Uh, oh, here we go. He got some zealot, or not zealot, stalkers. You guys know what they are. Good old Chris Hansen here to help us out today. Uh, I should have kept kiting my zealots. Stalkers just don't survive to zealots. They're too beefy. Who cares? We keep living. Oh, don't kill that stalker. I need him. There we go. That's some good control there. And I got... Oh, let's see. I put down a secret pylon back here to warp in more units. I missed that because I'm a noob. And uh, I'm outnumbering him his own base. Switch the warp gates quickly. Get that probe back to work. 
Let's see. Oh, this guy's doing a pretty good job holding off my harass. You know what he really needed more, though, was uh, zealots. Like, I only had two zealots. These are the same two zealots I started off with. That's just pretty awesome to me. I think. Yeah, I got some more stalkers here. Let's see if I can get this guy out of here. I got to control him really well. Oh, my gosh. Get him in the corner. Yes, that's perfect. That He'll live that way. Nope. Oh, and then I fight in a choke. That's stupid. But if I look at the units lost, I'm currently ahead. And spoiler alert, I didn't steal that from Husky. I'm going to lose just as many as he does. So not a bad trade. I think we come out about the same. So he's got 30 food right now. He's probably going to warp in some more soon. I have no fighting units. So that macro fail, macro fail. But I got a fourth gateway and a nexus. That's what I was thinking. So many minerals. Time to make a nexus. And there's a stalker over here in the shadows waiting for them to move out. That is too stalker heavy. Protoss players, just make sure you get more unit composition than stalkers. Mass stalkers will work better than like mass sentry or mass zealot. But you really, look, I mean, I have four zealots in one sentry versus like eight, ten stalkers in one probe. Which, I, I guess he is kind of doing damage. But look how much damage those zealots can tank. They just do so well at that. And I should have fallen back a while back. But that's not too bad. Run, stalker. Oh yeah, you look like a freak when you run. I never noticed that on low. Let's see, four gateways. Uh, I'm getting a Twilight Council right now for charge, probably. Or blink, but since I kind of prefer zealots in PvP, just because zealots are cool, uh, I'm probably getting charge first. And there it is, charge. I'm thinking to myself, like, he is so stalker heavy. If I just get charge lots, I should be able to rape him in his throat. So let's see here. He has ten stalkers and three warp gates. His macro is not poor, but he's got a lot of energy saved up. Uh, I got four gates, and I'm upgrading. I've also canceled my expansion because I know he's about to push against me. I have too much energy. I am stupid. And I don't have any money to make any, or not money, minerals to make any units. So it's all going to come down to the force fields, or if he decides to just die. No! No force field! I'm going to die. Oh, uh. And he kills my first sentry. There's just, And then he falls back to run away from the three zealots of doom. And look what Ice Fang does. We're going to get you! No! Oh yeah, now you guys can see what wins soccer versus mini army. And soccer over here, yes. That is so beautiful and as long as as soon as this finishes if I've got enough zealots to take advantage of it it's just gonna destroy everything oh I bet you're putting down there's your proxy pylon make sure to put proxy pylons down and to use warp not warp gates hotkeys like neither of us are doing why do I don't wow my hotkeys failed this game there's no way to describe it and you are almost done Oh, come on. Let's see. He's sitting on a lot of minerals. He should have expanded right now. And I should be attacking right now. And I am. Go charge lots. You guys are the coolest. You're way cooler than marines with stem or zerklings with speed and cracklings, whatever they're called. Let's see. I, what really would have helped here is, first of all, this split wasn't bad because the stalkers weren't really helping against the kiting, uh, kiting stalkers down here. But I needed to ha use my force fields more effectively, which I don't. I don't like I said in my first video with Raven. I don't use force fields very well. So if I had put the force fields right here, or you know, up here technically back there, it would have been much more helpful. Now he's oh, fall back, stupid zealots! Fall back, you're gonna die, Briar! <laughs> oh, there's the reinforcements, and by reinforcements I mean run away. Let's see, food supply. Oh, look at that units lost. This is so cool. I I never, like, did I ever cast a PvP? I haven't casted that many games either, so I probably haven't casted a PvP yet. Uh, and I like watching these. They're way cooler than Colossus battles people make them out to be. I don't, I mean, sure, Colossus are really important, but you could also just get a Dark Shrine like I am, which somehow I know exactly when I'm getting it. Oh, Dark Shrine! I honestly thought this time he was going four gate or something like that. He just preserved his stalkers better than mine, and I pretty much just out macroed him kind of you see how he's got 700 minerals right now um yeah i didn't think that these were coming soon so i i knew that a dark templar would be fine to use here and most players 
go two gate robo or four gate in uh, PvP. And I think that if you started using Dark Templar against the four gate, it would be a, a slaughter. It's not even close. It's so hard to get detection for Protoss if you weren't already intending to get it. It's really hard to get a forge and cannons out. Okay, let's see what happens here though. Forge and cannons out or an observer. Pretty good force field there. Second one was able to get some of my units, but he missed all the charge lots. And the big problem about that is, I mean, these all these stalkers here. He outnumbers my charge lots, and he's got me in a choke. But then, oh, if he actually if he had stuck in that choke and focus fired, he might have been able to stop him. But now that I've got more reinforcements coming, I need to use guardian shield, even if it's just these guys over here. But look how much damage those charge lots can take. It's just amazing how powerful they are. My wife for hire and.